movie all star master Lee. and lulu all right we got a request from a fan here who has requested this about a hundred and one times no you did po not count it a hundred baby times. <laughs> i don't have to count it, it felt like a hundred and one times but it wasn't even like oh here's the latest hot band rap right? thing it was you need to react to taco putting on the ritz i'm like what? Interesting sound. <laughs> so I know the song "Putting on the Ritz." I putting on the Ritz. I don't, 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 don't. Like the song, the dude Taco. No, I did. I had to Google this up, and it does sound actually really interesting. Which is like, all right, man, we'll, we'll check it out. Mm -hmm. But this dude Taco, I guess, did his cover of this song "Putting on the Ritz" because it's an old, old song. Mm -hmm. He's Indonesian, mm -hmm. but he grew up, I guess, in the Netherlands, and he does a couple of these covers. And he's, uh, how would you say, he's kind of an eccentric character. He, other than that, I figured let's. We just, need to see it. Yeah, let's just. Check Check it out. Let's see why this guy was so obsessed with Taco. Like it's the next hot thing. This one didn't even come out. This version that he did came out in 1982. So it's kind of an older song. Yeah. But like, what's the fascination with Mr. Taco here? Yes. Are you Mr. Taco Papa? <laughs> well, because then I get it. But yeah, let's check it out because it's a good song, actually. All right. That's his real name, Taco. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Indonesian Dutch boy who has a Mexican name. Nice. Maybe it has a different meaning on their language. Could be. Maybe in Indonesian taco means something that doesn't mean taco. Because <laughs> uh, there's also a different meaning of taco, right? You're, you're right, right? Like right. pink tacos, right? There you go. <laughs> Speaking of pink tacos. If you want some hotness, <laughs> check out my fantasy show. <laughs> and if you want some wicked wild stories about Vegas, you got to check out my channel where there's a pink taco restaurant <laughs> here in Vegas. Yes, that's true. Oh yeah, I know this very soon. Don't you go where fashion sits? No, 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 no. Different types who wear a day coat, pants with stripes and cut away coat, perfect fits. Putting on the ritz. Dress up like a million dollar trooper. Trying hard to look like Gary Cooper. Come, let's mix where Rockefellers walk with sticks or umbrellas in the mitts. Putting on the ritz. Have you seen the well to do up and down Park Avenue on that famous thoroughfare with the noses in the air? High hats and arrow collars, white spats and lots of dollars, spending every dime for a wonderful time. If you're blue and you don't know where to go to, why don't you go where fashion sits? Putting on the ritz. Different types who wear a day coat, pants with stripes and cut away coat, perfect fits. Putting on the ritz. Dress up like a million dollar trooper. Trying hard to look like Gary Cooper. Come, let's mix where Rockefellers walk with sticks or umbrellas in the midst. Put on the ritz. Oh! Oh, you can tap dance. so creepy it's almost they're like vampires. halloween thing i think they're vampires I, I think he might be no they are the rest it's of like them. they're undead or something right it's like a party for the undead mm -hmm. 
time is right for us and we can move Move to the rhythm we can What the What happened? It's like the two Muppets up in the balcony. Alright, this song's getting trippy as fuck now. <laughs> Where is he going with this? Okay, so I mean, I see a picture of his profile. He doesn't look like this all the time. So clearly, this is some sort of act or something like that. It's very theatrical. Yeah, it's very theatrical. He's not like Elvira, where he dresses up like the undead, like as his gimmick all the time. I think (laughs) Taco the Living (laughs) Vampire. Taco the Living Vampire. What the hell? Yeah, at first I thought it was like, is he trying to be like Michael Jackson? (laughs) (laughs) That's fucked up. Maybe. No, that's not bad. I love Michael Jackson. No, but that was my first impression. And then it, all of a sudden I was looking at all the dancers. No, like, he looked oh, more they, like to be like a phantom like a of the opera. You know what? You know what it was actually evoking for me? Mm. At first I was like, this almost feels like it could have been a song in the movie Beetlejuice. Because it's all about the undead and there's something quirky and humorous about it at the same mm. time. Like that, if it, he was in that, I would like totally fit. And then halfway through when the lightning was shooting down everywhere, I was thinking Ghostbusters. Like he could easily have been like one of those ghosts that's escaped in a Ghostbusters oh, movie. Oh my god, name all the scary scary slash comedy <laughs> movies. It does has a kind comedy of does theme. a good vocal. Oh his voice he is can great. Perform, obviously. Yeah. yeah. yeah taco, I, I definitely man. recognize version <laughs> I definitely recognize this version of the song. I've heard it before. I just didn't realize the dude's name was Taco. So <laughs> I guess we learned something new. You know what? I think it was inspired from a movie with Gene Wilder in it where the, the song was in it. Oh, we'll react to that next because uh, <laughs> I'm sort of thinking it was actually. Okay. Yeah. That one's even more wild than this. Okay. Maybe that's why there's like this undead theme. Uh, I don't know why this me. song suddenly has some like undead theme throughout it because I don't think that was the intention initially. But nonetheless, thank you, sir, for the recommendation. Thank you. you can now. Uh, rest in peace you can move on i was gonna say uh, rest in peace from like is that appropriate well i guess what i'm trying to say is you can move on with your life <laughs> right your, your dream has been achieved unless you have like a list of 50 more songs but it was a fun recommendation oh though. yeah we appreciate that <laughs> 